meet somebody yes, yes. for lunch that day, but I couldn't remember who it is. I remember. I like that. I was just thinking that too. That was my favorite. Oh, this bad. 30 seconds. We made the idea. Yeah. 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 It makes perfect sense. Yeah. That was Abbott's. I Pines, Pincushion, Yosemite's lush valley, like a crowd observing the copper hay sunset on the shaded granite walls. So our colors are El Dorado, spruce gray, copper haze, and shaded granite. I like your title. Are you, are, is this group ready now? Yes, okay. and, and Gail and Doug are still married. <laughs> 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 I've heard of paint chip pork and they're paint chip the wars. <laughs> <laughs> we have a hard time agreeing on paint chip. Uh, this is titled Bug Army. Basking bugs of terracotta rose congregate in a crossfire of protection as they eat the dark French chocolate aphids among the brown basket branched understory hovering over the new green grass floor of the forest. And our colors were terracotta rose, crossfire, dark French chocolate, brown basket, and new green grass. I like the color crossfire. It's very cool. Good job. This table. Where's the Under the azure sea. Under the azure sea, making its way along the corduroy road of autumn gold, the marble knight makes his way on <coughs> legs of Indian teal in the sea of autumn. And they wandered off. Like some light. And your colors. Autumn gold, corduroy, Indian teal. And then we, we used medieval gold like cat's eyes green and that was wandering off. Okay. 
And the final table. This was just kind of fast. Um, <clears throat> last minute. The blue powder snow cap candy coated bottle brushed caterpillar ascends the agate green lichen mosaic of jungle moss deep bark. And our words were agate green, jungle moss deep, we didn't use cocoa puff, <laughs> blue powder, <laughs> and that's it. Did this, did this help? Oh, I know. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 I didn't tell you, you'd say, well, why did you tell me? No, we get one point to a minute. I think it, this, this could be to give it to me. <laughs> <laughs> so for homework, well, it's not these prey chickens, but you can also make up your own paint chip color. As I have done with this one, which I call Prairie Promise. It is the color of the inflated pouch of a courting male prairie chicken. Uh, from one of our core discovery people, um, her made up color was Lolita Green up here. And she says, Lolita Green, the color of the tiny green violet ear hummingbird, which is innocent and seductive. <laughs> this caused quite a ruckus in the class because <laughs> one of the people in the class had a teacher whose name was Lolita Green. <laughs> 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 Be quick, 
A dark canopy extinguishes the frame. The flame. And then the final one is a list poem, where and I, Michael has shown a couple examples of this today in his photo journaling. But again, it's just simple white blossoms. And then I just list three, three petals, three leaves, three sepals, great white trillium. So it was just a simple um, statement of the facts of a trillium. So even, you know, I'm just not spouting these things out. I use these, I use them a lot. And to me, they're just touchstones to help me, to help me write. And I did make my one week, uh, my one week deadline. I have one quote to end today. Another Pete Dune. There was a silence for the time, and that was time enough to let a wordsmith savor the taste and texture of a fresh new phrase. Some people collect coins, some collect stamps. I collect words and terms, and the one I had just been handed was a gem, onion snow. And that's a description. It could be a paint color. It'd be kind of maybe, I don't know, I think of a mushy onion.